Yes, sir. Quite a swarm. Thank you for <laughs> flying me home. Oh, no, really, it's no problem. I mean, my pleasure. No, <laughs> oh, it's that late, is it? <laughs> well, it was nice meeting you. Uh, April, is it? Or May. Uh, May, yes. Later than I thought. Huh? <laughs> Very funny, Virgil. <laughs> it's Horace, actually. Oh, I'm sorry. The buzz at the party was so loud. <laughs> so you're a May Mayfly, huh? Yeah, guess my parents didn't have much imagination. Oh, they may fly. You don't live with your parents, do you, May? Uh, n no, they, they died around dawn this morning. <laughs> oh. Mine died around dawn, too. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd better be going now. <laughs> Would you like a drink? I'd love a drink, actually. Uh, let me just turn on a couple of fireflies. Oh, wow. Great pond. I love the lily pad. Oh, that. No, it's just there. It kind of grew on me. Care to take the load off your wings? Oh, that's all right. I'll just, you know, hover. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Oh, I'm sorry. Did we collide? Oh, no. It's I've only been in wings about six hours. <laughs> really? So have I. Oh, it wasn't molting disgusting? Uh, I'm glad that's over. <laughs> Would you like to listen to some music? I've got the Beatles, the birds, the crickets. The crickets? I, I love the crickets. Well, so do I. <laughs> so, are you seeing any other, I mean, are there any other <laughs> mayflies in the neighborhood? No, it's mostly walks. <laughs> So you live all, all alone? All by my lonesome. <laughs> then we look at that moon. <laughs> no, I think that's the first moon I've ever seen. That's the first moon I've ever seen? Really? Isn't that funny? When were you born? Around 7.30 this morning. So was I, 7.33. <laughs> Isn't that funny? <laughs> or maybe it's fate. <laughs> so all that moon. <laughs> oh, jeez. I think that is having a very emotional effect on me. <laughs> me too. It must be nature. Me too. Or <laughs> fate. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> a frog? A frog? Ah, the frogs are coming! The frogs are coming! The frogs, the frogs, the frogs are coming! It's okay. Oh it's my okay. goodness. I think he's gone now. Oh my goodness, that scared me. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only drawback to living here. The frogs. No, I like frog literature and frog films. I just really don't like frogs. <laughs> so rude if you're not a frog yourself. Oh, look at me. I'm shaking. Um, uh, well, why don't I fix you something? Perhaps a grasshopper, a singer? Uh, just some stagnant water would be fine. <laughs> Algae and that some. And straight up. Okay. <laughs> sure, can I use you to try out the lily pad? Just just for a second. Mm. <laughs> there you go. Cheers, Horace. Long life, May. Mm. Would you like to watch some tube? Sure, what's on? <laughs> You've got the love bug, M butterfly, spider stratagem, travels with my aunt. Angels and insects, the fly. Oh, the original or Jeff Goldblum? Jeff Goldblum. Mm, too gruesome. <laughs> Swamp life and life on Earth. Oh, what's on that? Looks like Born Yesterday with Sir David Attenborough. That sounds good. Shall we try it? Carpe diem. Wait, car carpe diem, what, what's that? I don't know, it's Latin. <laughs> what's Latin? I don't know, I'm just the main fly. <laughs> Oh, and right on time for it. Hello, I'm David Ottenborough. Welcome to Swamp Life. Isn't this comfy? Oh, is my wing in your way? Oh, or no, this? it's fine. You may not believe it, but within this seemingly lifeless puddle, there thrives a teeming world of vibrant life. May, I think that's your pond. I think that is my pond. He said puddle. This puddle <laughs> is only several inches across, but its stagnant water plays host to 14 gazillion different species. It is my pond! <laughs> Every species here is engaged in a constant, desperate battle for survival. Feeding, meeting, mating, breeding, 
and die and mating, meeting, mating, feeding, dying, mating, mating, meeting, breeding, brooding, breeding, it goes like a breed, feeding, uh, All right, Sir Dave. <laughs> Mating, 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 and mating. Only one thing on his mind. <laughs> Films on television these days. Tonight we start off with one of the saddest creatures ah, in this environment. The dung beetle. The toad. <laughs> the lowly mayfly. Did he just say the mayfly? He just said the lowly mayfly. Yes, the lowly mayfly. Like these two mayflies, for instance. May, I think that's us. Oh my god. God! We're, we're on, on television. television! I don't believe it! I wish my mom were here to oh, see this! This is amazing! Oh, God, I look terrible! Oh, you look very good. I can't look at this. As you can see, the lowly mayfly is not one of nature's most attractive creatures. Well, at least we don't wear safari jackets. <laughs> I wish he'd stop saying lowly mayfly. The lowly mayfly has a very distinctive... I think there's something wrong with my antenna. Oh, you don't have cable? Not on this one. <laughs> no. And 60 tons of droppings. That fixed it. Why don't I get you something to eat? I've got some plankton in the pond and some very nice mat. I love good mat. <laughs> I'll sit it out. You can sit. The lowly mayfly appeared just some 350 million years ago. Oh, that's exciting. And it's one of the order of the Epimetrotera, meaning living for a single day. I didn't know that. Living for a single day, huh? Here you go. Oh my gosh, May, this looks beautiful. I've got curried gnats, salted gnats, Scottish smoked gnats. Oh, I love that. Gnat with pesto, gnat au naturel, and gnat king cold. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't think I could finish a whole one. Not to worry. <laughs> <laughs> There's some left to dip in the center there. Dig in. As for the life of the common fly. Oh, so we're common now. It's a simple round of meeting, mating, here we go again. Feeding, breeding, feeding. This dip is fabulous. And dying. Chief? Oh, thank you. Mayflies are a major food source <laughs> for trout and salmon. Would you look at that savagery? That poor, poor mayfly. Fishermen like to bait hooks with mayfly lookalikes. Those jerks! And then there's the giant bullfrog. <laughs> uh, a frog, a frog! Uh, the frogs are coming, coming! The frogs are coming! A oh, frog! Uh, Welcome to Swamp Life. Hello. It's funny how we flew into each other's wings. It is funny. <laughs> We're faint. Do you think he's gone? David Attenborough? The frog. <laughs> <laughs> what frog? As you can see, mayflies can be quite affectionate. <laughs> <laughs> Mutually palpitating their proboscis. You know, I've been wanting to palpate your proboscis all evening. I think it was a lot of at first sight. <laughs> Rub my antenna. <laughs> Sometimes me, I'd like to rub a ton of things. Oh, darling. Oh, do, darling, do. <laughs> Is it not a picture? Now get a load of me. <laughs> Unfortunately, for this insect, the mayfly has a lifespan of only one day. What was that? The mayfly has a lifespan of only one day, living just long enough to meet, mate, have offspring, and die. You say meet, mm. mate, have offspring, and die? I did. In fact, the mayfly is born at 7.30 in the morning will die by the next dawn. <laughs> We're going to die! We're going to die! Mayday, 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 mayday we're, we're going, going to die! die. We're, we're going, going to die! die. What time is it? What time is it? I don't know. I'm a mayfly. Oh I don't wear goodness. a watch. Oh I, think, I think we're having an asthma attack. And mayflies have asthma? I don't know what <laughs> Mr. Safari jacket. Oh, God. Oh, maybe I put a paper bag over my head. or uh... Isn't that beautiful? Do you have a paper bag? So this is my life. Do you have a paper bag? A bang, a bambino, a boom. That's it? May, do you have a paper bag? I don't have time to look for a paper bag. I'm going to be dead soon. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, wait, that wasn't a whole hour. Oh, time's moving so fast now. Shut up! This explains everything. We were born this morning, we had puberty mid-afternoon, our biological clocks went bong, and here we are, hot to copulate. It's the one brief, miserable time we get to do it. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Talk fast! Well, what makes you think it would be so brief? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I insult your experience? 
Are you more experienced than I am, Dr. Ruth, luring me here to your pad? I see, I see. Blame me. <laughs> well, can I just remind me, we only get one shot of this, and I have some very entomatological questions to sort out right now, if you don't mind. So I'm just a babe here, is that it? I'm just a piece of tail? I'm not the one who suggested television. <laughs> I'm not the one who suggested life on Earth. Ooh, swamp life, that sounds interesting. <laughs> There's a frog up there. Oh, I'm scared. I'm terrified. We're down here. Come and get us. Feeding, dying. Breeding, dying. That's the whole plan? To a mayfly to make more mayflies? Does the world need more mayflies? Well, apparently we're a good source for trout and salmon. How nice for the salmon. Would you like some more food? I'd rather lost my appetite if you don't mind. Oh. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Really, it, it didn't mean it. Mayo. Lee? Thank you. Really, May, I didn't mean to snap at you. You've been really kind. Under the circumstances. Oh, Horace, I had such plans. Such wonderful plans. I wanted to visit Paris. What's Paris? I have no freaking idea. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe we'll come back as caviar and find out. <laughs> I just wanted to live till Tuesday. <laughs> What's a Tuesday? <laughs> oh God, Horace, the sun's almost up. I'm scared. I am so scared. You know, May, we really haven't known each other that long, and we don't have that much time left. But I'm going to say it. I think you're swell. I think you're divine. From your buggy eyes to the thick, raspy hair on your legs to the intoxicating <laughs> scent of your secretions. Ew! No, ooh, I say what? And I say, who cares if life's a swamp? We're just a couple of bugs in a tiny little pond. I say, live, May. I say, live. But how? I don't know that. You can fly to Paris. We could fly to Paris. Do we have time to fly to Paris? Carpe diem. What's that? It means bon voyage. Then we're out of here. <laughs>